Hi guys, I would like to show you how to replace keyboard on HP Envy X360. I got model number here 50M BQ021DX. So I got new keyboard from China. I already disassemble laptop, so video will be quicker. Uh, unfortunately, you will need to take out motherboard and uh, very bad, bad part about this replacement it keyboard doesn't attach by screws it attached by just plastic unfortunately So what I'm doing, I just, by using strippers, I'm taking off top part of the plastic. So you need to take off just a little bit, so we will be able to use rest of plastic to mount everything back. So be careful, don't strip all the way down, just remove round circle. I will try to show you, so, alright, like this. Honestly, it's a pure design, because it takes a while. But... We need to do whatever we need to do. Okay, let me finish. Okay, let's lift this part, aluminum part up. Okay, There's something is holding right here. I need to remove the screw. Okay. One more guy here, all right, and another guy right here. Okay, almost. Okay, also this flex attached by glue, so you will need to remove it as well. Right here. Okay. Okay, and here we go. Our keyboard waiting for us. Let's see. Okay, here we go, old keyboard removed successfully, 
and uh, I just have not working those three keys unfortunately so let's put new one back in Okay, um, right here I have iron, so um, you can use this iron to melt down plastic, so that's why you did need to save some plastic to, uh, to m fix everything, almost like it was before. <laughs> So I will suggest you to put your iron, if you have adjustable temperature iron, on the minimum temperature. Uh, just practice, I don't know which temperature will work for this kind of plastic, but we'll try for, uh, I will try one tori. And let's see what happened. Yeah, looks like yeah, looks like holding. So, pretty much that's it. I will finish those pads, and um, I guess you know how to put screws back in. And I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching, and have a good day.